Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you a couple of my acrylic pores that I did using Proper Jobs PVA glue. Now I would stress to you, this is not the original first acrylic pour that I did. It's actually underneath this uh, true ring pour that I did not filmed because I had a bit of an issue with getting the Horatio right with Proper Jobs PVA glue. So that's the first thing I want to start off with. Obviously Horatio is very very important to get right, especially on a big size like this. Because I didn't put enough water in, it didn't actually cover the whole MDF board. I think it covered only about this much and that's one of the reasons why it probably didn't work the first time. And also I didn't actually do a bit of negative space around the corners which normally helps it flow a bit better. When I eventually did get the Horatio right, I think it was on my third attempt, it worked like a dream. I cannot say there's anything bad with the proper gels PVA glue because it just worked. It was exactly the same consistency as Poundland apart from when you did mix it up you do need to put a little bit more water in. But in terms of holding the colour of the acrylic paints that I'm currently using which is Classmates Ready, Mi Ready Mix Paint and when it dries there was no cracking and there was a little bit of separation down here in these little bits but I put that down to the amount of paint that was already on this because I did do three pours on top of each other that weren't dry. So this is another true pour that I did not filmed because underneath it just didn't work as well and obviously I was still having a bit of issue with Horatio of not putting enough water in it so it didn't flow off the canvas as much as I thought. Going straight back onto it with another acrylic pour but this time truing pour it worked to my success and it really really did hold the colours really really well. There wasn't much muddying with this kind of colour comp combination it, I would have thought there would have been just because of the nature of chewing pores and sometimes PVA glue can't actually hold very well chewing pores compared to a flip cup which I find very, very weird <laughs> but um, that's just one of the things for you and yeah no, no like craving or like much cracking obviously you're going to get a little bit around the sides because I was still getting the Horatio right but apart from that nothing really too serious in terms of cracking, colorization, or anything really. A very, very cool, very, very cool and interesting uh, composition and canvas really. So these next two, I do have to put a little bit of disclaimer in. Basically, it's not fully using pound, uh, not pound lines, uh, proper jobs PVA glue because it was two dirty pores that I did and it, it was mostly filled with proper jobs PVA glue, but there was a small percentage of Poundland's PVA glue which was the white. This one turned out the best, this was the first one that I did. Obviously you can see the white and that's the Poundland PVA glue interacting with it. But it's very very good to know that if you do put in two different mixtures of PVA glue they do tend to work okay together. Especially with the Poundland's PVA glue and the Proper Jobs PVA glue. Don't know if that's the same for every single other PVA glue that I can think of. But yeah it did turn out too bad the colour is still there uh, there is some craving obviously that you can see and some separation but it goes with the composition and the kind of texture of the whole thing so I'm not too worried about this one it was this one that I was a bit I'm an ahhing about because I'm not sure if I like this quite yet around the edges you can see it's very very thin and weak which normally you don't get from like doing PVA glue acrylic pores but I'm just going to put this down to the fact that it was a week long dirty pour. Despite it working with this one, this one it just didn't work as well. And I will be pouring over this one again. There was a couple others but obviously they were underneath canvases and MDF boards that I've already used or covered up already that I've shown you. I hope this review is helpful and excitable. If you have any questions please leave them down in the description box below. The Horatio that I did work out to be the better of the lot if that makes any sense, it was 20% water, 50% acrylic paint and 30% of the PVA glue. That will alter definitely with different types of PVA glue because my PVA glue, different types of acrylic paint because my acrylic paint is actually quite, I don't want to say runny but it's much more runnier than let's say Crawford and Black that I've used in the past. So obviously if you do end up using PVA glue make sure you do check the Horatio on a smaller canvas before you go up to a bigger canvas like I did <laughs> and then you end up wasting paints and etc etc so yeah 
let me know if there's any questions you want me to answer down below in the description box in the description box in the comments section below also don't forget to check out my description box with all my social medias and also my ebay selling account which is where i sell all my artworks if you're very very interested i shall see you guys for my next video bye